Hey, what's up? I'm Brett with Premier Guitar, rocking and rolling at the NAMM Show, summer 2010, with Russell Pace from Pacer Concepts. Tell us about this. What we got is a stalker. Um, it's it's going to solve an issue that uh, we hope everyone in the world jumps aboard. First of all, there's there's no better or safer environment for a guitar than a hard case. We, we all know that. But these days, uh, most of the publications released today are releasing information saying that gig bag sales outweigh hard case sales by almost 80% to 20%. So people, guys, are moving, guys and girls are moving to gig bags more so than hard cases. So there's no hard tail protection typically for a guitar in a gig bag. And folks travel on airplanes, cars, whatever, walking around subways, things get bumped around. So we came up with this guy, the stalker. It's a hard shell case for the headstock of a guitar in a gig bag. Pretty easy to use. Slips on the guitar, slips off the guitar. One so, easy quick motion. Now, you guys introduced this product a little some time ago, but you did something different now. We did. We we got such an overwhelming response that we of can you make this fit more guitars than just the Fender knockoffs? And we did, so we did a huge draft reduction inside. Extra channels, extra grooves, different types of felt padding on the inside. And uh, this guy here actually fits a lot more guitars. It's, it's ABS medical grade plastic, so it's a little bit more flexible, has a memory to it, so that if it meets a guitar, it's n not really comfortable at the first, it grows to it. It'll uh -huh. actually morph to the shape of that guitar. So. More universal fits more styles. Yeah. You can actually see how it works right here. I got a clear one to represent, uh, to show you what actually goes on. Inside the headstock, I mean, in protector, the tuning keys live in this top area, and we mount an interface with the hardware on the guitar, not necessarily the wood. But the wood that does come close to the guitar, we put the felt strips on to protect it in case it does. Yeah, and so uh, the impact on tuning. Tuning is great. Um, instructors love this, schools love this because if they've got younger students that aren't proficient at tuning yet, the instructors will tune the guitar for them, throw one of these on the guitar, back into the gig bag, and the guitar will stay in tune for the most part. Um, students will actually practice a little bit more while the guitar is in tune. It does stop the inside of the gig bags from getting shredded too. This is one of the things that uh, added bonus that we didn't really think about when we designed it, but one of the things that it benefits from. One other thing I saw that you guys were doing um, that's kind of cool, and this is uh, this is something that's maybe more um, for a manufacturer, per absolutely, se. absolutely. This here is a, a we make these styrofoam versions, and what they do is they, they work inside existing packaging systems for guitar manufacturers, so they don't have to change a thing, but they can still benefit by the stalker and all the shockproof protection we can give them right here. They're uh, basically pennies. So if a manufacturer is shipping, say, a hundred guitars overseas or something like that, um, these will really help them keep their headstocks from getting cracked and shipping. Absolutely. Or... And, and most, of the, most retail outlets understand how difficult it is to get POs issued for luthier costs, more shipping and receiving back and forth, fighting with different types of uh, shipping vendors that we all use from day to day. It just easy very inexpensive way to reduce all that hassle on the storefront. Oh, very cool. A simple, novel, great idea. Yeah, Russell, we, what, uh, what's your website if people want to find out more about your company? PacerConcepts.com. And one of the things that you'll get to see on the website are the new prototypes we're releasing for the acoustic guitars. And we have one coming up for Gibson lovers that actually takes the shock right out of the headstock, transfers it into the body when they fall over, the headstocks don't snap off anymore. There you really go. cool. No more headstock repairs. No. Hey, I'm Brett. You're watching PremierGuitar.com.